Good morning. I'm going to do a quick demold video of the lizard. Um, now, by nature, he is delicate because he has got feet and he's got a tail. Um, and one, what I want to do is, obviously, we've designed the mould to try and make it as easy as possible for the end user. Um, I'm going to show you how to demold him. Along the way, I think you are going to get possibly a few broken feet, which can be glued back on. Um, but you are going to get some broken feet um, until you've got the knack of being delicate with him and how to get him out without breaking any parts. So to start, we are just gonna release him all the way around. Now remember, these are delicate. So we're gonna get our hand under his body. So once we've released everything, get your hand under his body. Now what you wanna do, is these two are the most delicate, is you wanna, so I'm just gonna try and get my hand under a little bit further. Just trying to get these out of the way and we're going to pull them back completely clear of his feet so that we can wiggle his head out. Okay, and once we've wiggled his head out, we have got a lizard. There are going to be certain bits that you're going to need to trim off um, or not fill exactly to the top. Um, obviously, the deeper you fill, the more lizard... Um, you're going to have the fat of the lizard, you can obviously sand him down, but there he is. Like I said, he's delicate, you are going to um, experience broken limbs, but you will get the hang of getting him out in one piece. 